Hello again. This is Math 1220 coming to you from the College of DuPage. And the title of this lecture is Low Stakes Assessment 4, also known as LSA number 4. And this is due uh, March 17th near midnight. As always, be an attentive learner while watching this video. Uh, so here's uh, a problem. I will read it uh, with you. Uh, cell phones and cancer. A study of uh, 420,095 Danish cell phone users found that 0.0321% of them developed cancer of the brain and the nervous system. Prior to the study of cell phone use, the rate of such cancer was found to be 0.0. 0.340% of those not using cell phones. And the data is from a journal of National Cancer uh, Institute. Use the sample data to construct a 90% confidence interval of the percentage of cell phone users who develop cancer of the brain or nervous system. And then use that information and the information in the problem to determine, do the cell phone users appear to have a rate of cancer of the brain or nervous system that is different from the rate of such cancer among those not using cell phones? And then you're to explain your answer with why or why not. And there's a second problem. It is this one, it deals with the Atkins Weight Loss Program. In a test of weight loss um, programs, 40 adults used the Atkins Weight Loss Program. After 12 months, their mean weight loss was found to be 2.1 pounds with a standard deviation of 4 pounds. Construct a 90% confidence level uh, interval estimate of the mean weight loss for all such subjects. And then there are two questions. Does the Atkins program appear to be effective? And does it appear to be practical? In closing, now more than ever, time is precious. Each day must count. Do the math, it will make you strong. And now more than ever, take care of yourself and of each other. May God bless you all. And I look forward to seeing you in uh, the VCM class.